Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel where we're about that breaking cycle of life. Wow, it's such a beautiful morning. Honestly, do you hear the birds? Wow, it's really peaceful in the morning to, you know, wake up to this and just sit in silence and enjoy this beauty and this peace. But this week, this week on Our Testimony Thursday, we have a returning subscriber, a returning friend. She is none other than Anya Jean and God has been working in her life. And she just wanted to share with you what God did for her and that he can do it for you too because God definitely takes care of his children. And he definitely moves in mysterious ways that you're just sitting there and looking like, what? So Anya Jean's story this week is pretty much similar to something that happened to me with China and how quickly it went through and how God really put his hand in the process. So I hope you enjoy it and I hope you will be encouraged because guys, it definitely encouraged me. So let's get to the video, okay? Bye, have a great day. Hello everyone, my name is Annie Jean Phillips and I'm so happy to be on this platform yet another time, praise be to God, to share a quick testimony. I'm sorry it's night time where I am, so I hope you're seeing me clearly and hearing me pretty audibly. Now, just in recent time, the Lord has been so good to me. Coming into 2022, I just had a sensing that it was going to be a year of expectancy for me. I didn't know expectancy of what or you know, I didn't have all the, the information, so to speak, but I just got the sensing in my spirit that I was to go into 2022 expecting and I'm still going through expecting great things from the Lord. And one such great thing happened even before 2022 began, which was um, me landing a job uh, in a field that I've been trying to penetrate for the longest while. And that would be um, broadcasting. I And how it happened is so funny. I A friend of mine said to me, hey, I hear that this radio station is looking for persons. Um, I think you should apply. Like the person would have texted that to me like today. Today's what? Wednesday? Today, Wednesday. And I really never acted upon it until like a week after, if not later. And um, when I did, I just sent in a short clip. You needed to do like a, like a, like a demo, so to speak, um, of you reading like a news clip or something, just so they could hear how you speak. And I did that. And if the demo was 15 seconds or let me not say if the, de if the demo was 30 seconds, that's a lot. I don't even think it was that long. And I just sent out, you know, kind of like a dry email to say, hey, I heard you're looking for persons. See demo below. Uh, my name is so and so and attach my resume. And um, in no time. I was contacted and what really wowed me. And of course, you know, cause a long story short, I got the job though in a part-time position. I believe it is a stepping stone in the right direction. and It's a foot in the door. Um, but what surprised me really was when I did the interview with the managing director, he said to me that, you know, um, by the time we got your email, the applications were actually closed off, but, um, something, he said, something told him to still read my email and to still set an appointment to see me and i'm here today to tell you that could only be god and i'm also here today to tell you that god qualifies the called he qualifies those whom he calls um if you check bible if you check history god used the most um unexpected of persons he chose fishermen he chose tax collectors he chose he he did great works with with prostitutes with harlots with people that society would have written off with people who society would deem underqualified or unfit for the job and i am living testimony of that now this position that i would have um been privy to at this broadcasting house i have no experience in broadcasting i only have a voice and i guess that is enough for the lord to use and i know the favor of god and the hand of god is upon my life richly and so that is my encouragement and my testimony tonight today this afternoon whenever you will see this video right here on this platform shani Waterburn ellis's youtube channel a powerful platform where she emphasizes and she makes it her duty to share the word of god i am telling you god when god is in your life and when god's hands hands are upon your life 
uh, you defy odds and your your qualifications and your resume is is one thing. But when God is moving on your behalf and opening doors on your behalf, you know that's that's just paper. That's just documentary. Um, but God God doesn't is not bound by resumes. He's not bound by qualification. When God gets ready to move, you better move with Him. That's my encouragement. Stick and stay with God. Stay faithful in serving in whatever season he has you in right right now. I know it might not be easy. Trust me, I've been there. I've been in the period of waiting, still in a period of waiting to an extent. And I know it can be very difficult and very tedious and very discouraging at times. But when the Lord gets ready to move on your behalf, trust me, he moves. Have a blessed day, everyone. Mm -hmm.